Hello again, I'm Rodney Reynolds from FreeGameMan.com, and this next Q&A video is about 80 plus certification. What does it all mean? Like 80 plus bronze, platinum, titanium, you know, where exactly and how did all this start? Well, basically, 80 plus is a voluntary certification that companies get done to their power supplies, and it was started in 2004 by a company that was called Ecos Consulting. And what they did was certify power supplies at 20, 50, and 100% load. So let's just go through some of the different certifications. At, now I'll do these at 50% load because usually that's going to be the highest efficiency on whether you're talking about um, in North America or over in Europe. And by the way, here in North America, where I am, it's 115 volts. The efficiencies uh, are a little bit higher over in Europe, but I'll just go through the North American ones here. For an 80 plus straight up certification, it would need to be at least 80% efficient. That's at 50% load. All of these will be at 50% load. 80 plus bronze, 85% efficiency. Silver certification, 88% efficiency. Gold certification, 90% efficiency. Platinum is 92 and titanium, wow, is 94. Again, these are a little bit higher over in Europe where the voltage is different, 220 as opposed to 115. So, you know, that remains to be seen does it mean anything to you? Maybe, maybe not. If you want to save energy over the long term, yes. If you want to be good to your environment, of course, get a power supply that at least meets the 80 plus certification because that way you know that, well, you're kind of saving the planet and you're also saving money in the long term. Certainly, you know, a straight up 80 plus certified power supply isn't going to cost nearly as much as a platinum or a titanium one, but in the long run, especially if you have a company, it will save a tremendous amount of money. So that's the good thing about getting a super efficient power supply and a lot of us these days you know we have servers at home we have home theater pcs that are streaming content at home and it's really on all the time 24 7 i mean a lot of time it doesn't get used you might use it three or four hours a day and then it's on the entire day so for that particular use servers and other computer systems that have to be on all the time 24 7 going with a certainly a gold platinum or even a titanium power supply would definitely be the way to go now i'm going to do a poll as a follow-up to this q a video and i will link that above when it is live and you can go over there and vote as to what efficiency power supply you have whether you have you know, a below, you don't, yours is not even 80 plus certified, or maybe, you know, yours is gold or platinum or whatever else. So I'll link you to that poll when I do release it. You can go over there and check that particular uh, video out. Again, I'm Rodney Reynolds from 3dgameman.com. You can head over to 3dgameman.com if you have a question, or you can just post it below. But for this particular Q&A video, I'd love to hear your uh, input from you on what you think about these efficiencies and if you think it's something that is beneficial uh, to us all in the long run.